Hi friends, welcome to Silas Kitchen for quick and delicious recipes. Today we are going to make pineapple rice. It's a very very delicious rice with very simple ingredients. Let's look at the ingredients. We have cloves. These are around six to seven cloves. We have rice which I just washed um, and put it on a paper towel so that excess water is absorbed. And we have um, a, a can of pineapple pieces. If you can get fresh pineapple, you can use always use fresh pineapple. I advise using fresh ingredients. But if you are not, because I was in a rush today, so I, I bought the uh, uh, canned pineapple, which is in the pineapple juice. One thing to note is that if you're using fresh pineapple, you'll also need a bowl of sugar. If not, you can always use uh, pineapple juice. All right, let's begin. All right, so I've kept the pan on medium heat and I'm going to add around three teaspoons of clarified butter it's rich um, recipe so if you if you want you can always skip butter use you can use margarine you can use normal butter you can always use um, you know um, a substitute as well but I try to use uh, clarified butter because it gives out its own aroma and gives it a rich taste to our rice once the butter heats up a little bit I'm going to add in the cloves because the cloves are going to depart out a nice aroma to our rice And then once the cloves starts heating up, we are going to add the rice in, roast it a little bit and then add the pineapple pieces and juice. Alright, the clarified butter is, is up to the heat. The cloves are starting out to give their aroma. Wow! Let's add in the rice. And we, got, we are continuously going to stir this so that the rice does not burn and the rice will slightly change the color it will um, right now you will see that it's white and it's slightly become off white and then we are going to add the pineapple pieces and juice to it cover it up with the lid and our rice will be ready in eight minutes been a minute or two and the rice has been roasted you will see that it has slightly changed its color of the green and the aroma is fantastic so let's go add the pineapple pieces and juice to it and cover it up with the lid and let the rice cook You don't need to add any water for the pineapple juice and the pineapple pieces are going, going to release out their own juices. We will add a little bit of salt, a very little salt, um, not much, um, to just enhance the sweetness of the pineapples. very little salt and I'm going to reduce the heat and then let it cook for another seven to eight minutes and our rice will be ready oh I forgot to uh, mention one more thing now you will notice that the pineapple do have uh, a yellow color to them but if you want to enhance that color, you can always add some yellow food color to the rice while it's cooking. Okay. 
so it has been around eight minutes wow amazing aroma look at it mm. and our rice is ready thank you all for watching this video for more such recipes keep watching silas kitchen please subscribe and do post your feedback in the comment sections bye bye